I-44, some folks driving in Manatee County and near the Sunshine Skyway Bridge got quite the show. Here they are during some storms last night. Check out this video of a water spout spotted right around 6 p.m. Right now we know of three water spouts that formed last night, including twin water spouts near Egmont Key. What do they say in Twister? We've got twins. Yeah, wow. Yeah. Well, just, the good part is that stayed over the water. OK, uh -huh. so these were not tornadic water spouts, no damage, and that's the good news. And the way our the wind was blowing is it, it kept them offshore. It was when the uh, east wind moved to the west and met with some convergence and then it kept moving offshore where a lot of times here in Tampa Bay they come onshore right. uh, with those uh, becoming sometimes tornadoes. Scary right on damage. the beach so too. The flow today would uh, would actually support maybe more scenes like these. So I want to thank uh, Mr. Rushnell for sending these in. Send your photos in safely here. I'll step out of the way and open your cameras up. But there's another look. What an amazing sight, isn't it? So the twin water spouts there. But again, with that easterly flow today, uh, we're likely to see the convergence just offshore with that pinned sea breeze. Let's take a look at this meteorologically. So as we take a look at what caused this, well, OK, our Sunday water spouts, we had outflow boundaries and that east wind. So if you were outside this weekend, you remember it was real hot and you got these big rushes of wind and air. That's what we saw yesterday, creating a boundary. And with that sea breeze pinned along the coast, yeah, we had a light southwest wind. So what that does, yeah, it causes convergence. We got quite a collision in the atmosphere, so you get a little bit of an extra spin out there. And we had these little tiny showers popping up. So we had a couple of areas of convergence creating the rotation. And that's why you can have not one, but sometimes up to two or more water spouts at the same time with that rising air and the rotating column of air uh, causing those water spouts yesterday. So uh, as we look at the forecast today, again, we've got that easterly flow, light west wind right along the beaches. And I do see a, another chance of maybe seeing something like that. But Again, I expect that activity to stay offshore as water spouts. All right, so a very low severe weather risk. In fact, as we take a look